Hi, I'm Master Plumber Ed Delgrande, here to tell you that standard shower heads like this one use two and a half gallons a minute. Now, the new water-saving shower heads only use 1.75 gallons a minute, so that's a water savings of about 30%, and you really should upgrade from a standard shower head to get those water-saving numbers in your home. To change the heads, it's not too difficult, so let me show you how to do it. You will need a couple of wrenches. The first one is your back-off wrench, and I recommend putting some tape on the teeth here. That'll protect the chrome finish on the shower arm. All right, the second one is just a regular crescent wrench, and that'll fit into the two slots over here. So let's back this off, hold it in place, get your crescent wrench, tighten it up where you need it, and turn it. Once you get it loose, you can unscrew the rest by hand. Once the old shower head is off, now you really have to clean off the thread. You want to take off the old tape and debris on the threads. You can use your thumb and forefinger for that. And once it's cleaned off, you might even want to run the shower to wash out that shower arm. Once that's done, you can put your Teflon tape on. You can use Teflon tape or Teflon paste. Either way, roll it around the threads. If you're using the tape, make sure you go with the threads. That way, when you put on the shower head, the tape won't ball up on you. Now, get your new water-saving shower head and screw that into place. Start off by hand tightening it. And you can see this is a very nice looking shower head. You really can't tell the difference. And they're also engineered to give you a good strong spray. So even though you're saving water, you'll still get that good shower. All right, tighten it up as much as you can by hand, then get the wrenches again. Since we're tightening it up, we're gonna reverse our wrenches. Now your back off wrench will go there. And then we'll get our crescent wrench up here, adjust it to the slots and turn it now you want to give it a couple of turns snug it up but you don't want to go too tight it's always best to go back later and that's it the shower heads in place and i have to tell you if you want to save even more water just cut your showering time down by a minute and you could save hundreds of gallons of water a year so that's it i recommend you do this project at home and if you need more information please visit cola.com save water